time to settle the score. Eat a quickie today, folks. We've got an exhibition matchup on hand, and the Baseball Tonight crew is already arguing about who's going to come out on top. Coming up, it's the Atlanta Braves taking on the Arizona Diamondbacks. Here's our starting pitching matchup for today's game. Tim Hudson will be the Atlanta starter in this one. Hudson turned in another outstanding season last year. Injuries limited him to only 27 starts, but look at him. He finished with 12 wins and 6 losses, an ERA of 3-5-3. Russ Ortiz will also get the start for Arizona. He had some nice games last season. How else can you carry an ERA of just 4-10? Ready for baseball in Arizona, John Miller with a Hall of Famer Joe Morgan standing by on ESPN. Fellas? Okay, Carl. Outside, it is oppressively hot. We are inside the gigantic Bank One ballpark here in downtown Phoenix, Arizona, and we're ready for baseball. We're getting ready for some exhibition baseball now coming up. Today, it's the Atlanta Braves taking on the Arizona Diamondbacks. This is John Miller along with Joe Morgan, and we're ready to bring you all the excitement of this ball game. And Joe, before we get underway, very quickly, what's the key for Atlanta in this matchup? Well, John, just by looking at the numbers, you know that Chipper Jones is going to find a way to be a factor in this ball game. I mean, this guy continues to pile up some great numbers. He just drives in 100 runs every year. He's become a very good defensive player, and he hits for power from both sides. He's awesome. Russ Ortiz will be doing the pitching. He's got an ERA of just above 4.10. He was a 15-game winner last year. Pre-game warm-ups are over. It's about time for baseball. Thanks for joining us here on ESPN. First pitch, here it comes. This one swung on and fouled away. He throws. There's a swing and a line drive. Tracy is there and he puts it away for the out. Here's the batting order for the Atlanta Braves. Estrada is in the number four spot in the batting order. That's where the power hitters hit. One out, nobody on. First pitch to him. Here's a swing and a fly ball. Green runs over and puts it away for the out. Good range running to his right to put this one away. And here's how the Diamondbacks will look defensively. Bases empty, two down. First pitch on the way. Swung on and ripped towards second. Council puts it away in the side of the time. They go down quickly and quietly here. Now we'll go to the bottom of inning number one, and we have no score. Tim Hudson is going to be the starting pitcher in this one. He picked up 12 wins last season. He's allowed a batting average of 267 by the opposition this year. First pitch on the way. That swung on and a high fly ball to right. Mondesi is there and he puts it away for out number one. They had him play perfectly that time and the right fielder is able to make this play without much problem. Here's a look now at the batting order for the Arizona Diamondbacks. Luis Gonzalez is in the third spot. First pitch to him. Back one. The pitch. Hurt two. There's a swing and a fly ball down the line and left. And that's a fair ball heading towards the corner. The throw to second. He finds a pitch he can drive and his hands flow through the zone perfectly. He's in scoring position with one out. Here's a look at Atlanta's defense. One out, a runner on second. First pitch, here it comes. Ball one. This is just a wild pitch, John, and the manager's not happy. Well, it just got away from him. 
He's at the belt. The one. -up. This is swung on and a liner, and that one falls in their base hand. The throw to the plate. Well, a little one out base hit here. Let's see if they can parlay this into something special. Runners at first and third, only one out. First pitch on the way. Fastball swung on and missed 0 and 1. Good hard sinker that time, and he's in control. It's 0 and 2. He delivers. Fastball got it. Two down. Great location on this pitch. He kept it down and caught the corner. Sean Green comes in now. This past season he had 28 home runs. His career slugging percentage is at 508. Two men out. Two men out. The first pitch is a sinker in there. It's 0-1. Concentrate on putting the ball in play. Strikeout doesn't help you here. And the sinker swung on and missed, and the side is retired. He threw a sinker. Let's watch it on table. He's working the inside portion of the plate here and hoping to induce a swing, and it worked. He almost screwed himself into the ground. His swing was. So big on that one. He got handcuffed too, but he'll have to shorten his swing a bit next time if he wants to handle the pitch inside. So no runs on two hits and two left. We'll go to the top of the second, and we have no score. The heart of the order coming up next. Andrew, here's a swing and a soft liner towards left center. And it's in there, base hit. The throw to second. John, now they're really in business. A base hit with no one out. Runner at first, nobody out. First pitch, here it comes. Swung on and grounded towards the hole. The second for one. And two. A double play. He picked this one up nicely and then went around Cape Horn to get the double play. John, it's like infield practice, except this time they get two. Nice work to get the double play. Adam LaRoche comes to the plate. He had a total of 13 big flies last season. Finished on the ground to short. Clayton is up with it. And he throws on the first and the side is retired. Let's check out that play at first on replay. It was close. Let's see this again. Does he get him? Yes, sir. But not by much. Good hustle to get down the line quickly. No runs on one hit and nobody left out. Now we'll move on to the bottom of the second. Still no score. The numbers six, seven, eight hitters are coming up. Robbie Hammett will try and get something started. He's up third in the next inning. First pitch, here it comes. Man, sometimes that four-seam fastball up and in can be the strikeout pitch. The pitch. It takes a splitter in there, and it's 0-2 now. Two great pitches right on the edge. Now he's got him in trouble. You're Big there. swing and a miss on the changeup. He struck him out. What a way. Man, there's a pitch up in the zone. He swung right through it. He'll have to hit that one next time. Tracy comes up for the first time right now. Base is empty. One out. First pitch on the way. Starts him off with one at the knees for a strike. Hit in the air to center field. Jones is right there and he hauls it in. That's about as easy as it gets for a center fielder. Robbie Hammett steps in now. Last season he hit four out of the park. 18 runs batted in last year. Swings and misses at that fastball. It's 0 and 1. Took something off that time and he's in control. It's 0 and 2. With two strikes, you have to be more aggressive now. 
Fastball swung on a miss, and with that, the side is retired. Let's see this one again on KMO. It was a four-seam fastball. He just looks silly flailing away at this one, Joe, as if he was trying to swat bugs or something. Well, that's what pitches up and in can do to a hitter. If you miss it, you'll look foolish. Get this man a fly swatter. <laughs> nothing doing here this happening. We'll go to the top of inning number three, and our score is nothing, nothing. It's the last third of the batting order coming up. Raul Mondesi will be the first man up. Now here's a swing and a fly ball. Ferrero is right there and he hauls it in. He had a pitch to hit, but he's just a bit out in front and he sends an easy fly to center for the out. One out, none on. First pitch to him. Swing and a miss on the cutter. All in one. He deals. Grounded softly to short. Gloss has it. And he throws the first in time for our other two. Hudson is going to have a shot to get something done right here. Base is empty. Two down here. First pitch. Here it comes. Swing and oh, he shatters his bat as he hits this one on the ground. Throws the first in time. Now we'll get a chance, John, to see the slider on Kazon. Nothing across here in the end. And we move on now to the home half of the third in a scoreless ballgame. They'll start at the ninth spot and then go to the top of the order next. Craig Council is due up second in the next half inning. First pitch on the way. Ball a splitter ball. just misses. One ball, no strikes. Nice try. That pitch down the way, but the hitter was smart enough to lay off. Now the 1-0 pitch. Sinker waved at and missed. One and one. Here's the 1 1 delivery. Swung on and lined out to right center. And this one rolls all the way to the wall. The throw to third. I like his swing on that double. This is how you get things started for a good inning. Now with no outs, he's in scoring position. Nobody out, the runner at second. First pitch to him. Swing and a line drive for Collin. Has it, and the runner will have to hold at second base. And he is out at second. And he made a mistake there, Joe. He should have gotten back to the bag. And great awareness to throw behind him that time. Excellent defense. Royce Clayton comes up now. Last season, he had eight home runs with a career slugging percentage under 400. Cut on and missed. And it's 0-1. He delivers. Good hard side of that time. He's in control. 0-2. Swung on and grounded towards the hole. Jones is there. Throws on to first, and the side is retired. LaRoche with the off-balance throw to get his man. This is really a tough play to make. Doesn't have time to get himself upright and throw normally. He's got to whip this thing sidearm and he puts it right on the money for the out. So no runs, one hit, and nobody left. We're through three innings now, and we have no score. And the top of the order is coming up. Chipper Jones, a very feared hitter. He's set to bat third in the inning. He swings and it's a fly ball to right field. Green is there, and he puts it away for the first out. And he's pitching well right now. That's seven straight he's retired. Giles will be the batter. 0 for 1 thus far. First pitch on the way. Fastball swung on and missed. 0 and 1. Well, he's not afraid to pitch inside, and he gives you a pretty good example of that there. Whoa. Here's the 1 1 pitch. This ball is hammered down the left field line, but it goes foul. The one two pitch. This is swung on, and a liner counsel gets there in time to make the great running catch. This ball is smoked. He stung that one right to the second base. 
Jones comes in now. He's a switch hitter batting from the left side. Two outs, nobody on. First pitch to him. Now here's the ball grounded towards the hole. Well, the first two men were set down fairly quickly, but he keeps standing alive with a base hit. Estrada, a switch hitter, batting left-handed. First pitch, here it comes. And he fouls this one off. Foul ball. Now a throw over. And he's back easily, but he made a dive just to make sure. He kicks, he throws. Tried to get him to go after that slider, and it's one and one. Now he's set. Here's the one one pitch. He looks at a fastball in there, and it's one and two now. Here's the one two pitch on the swings. It lines this one towards the hole, and it drops in for a base hit. He tells the pitcher. You're not going to get us one, two, three. Good piece of two out hitting there. First pitch on the. This one swung on and hit on a line. Clayton on the run as he gets there in time to put it away. I'll tell you what, Joe, this is a great play. Here's another look at it. Definitely, John. You see several nice things going on here, and they execute the play like it's routine. No runs on a couple of hits and two men left. We go to the last of the fourth, and it's still nothing, nothing. The three, four, five spots in the order coming up next. Troy Gloss Four. is due up second, and you've always got to be very careful with him. Swings and misses at the good change. It's 0 1. Hit in the air to left center. And this one is into the alleyway and should be extra bases. The throw to third. That's a good at bat. The possible go ahead runs already in scoring position to lead off the inning. Gloss will be the batter. 0 for 1 thus far. There's a runner at second. No out yet. First pitch, here it comes. Took something off, and it swung out and missed. Strike one. And he delivers. Now the pitcher has him 0 and 2. He can do anything he wants. Fastball swung on and missed. He struck him out. One away. Seems like he's added a couple of feet on his fastball, John. It's getting by all these hitters. Three pitches and he's out. Great pitching here. Let's take a look at the replay. Yeah, strike one, strike two, strike three, and see you later. Sean Green up to the plate. This past season he had 28 home runs. His career slugging percentage is at 508. Well, you've got to be wearing a shin guard if you're going to swing at that pitch down and in. There's a swing and a ground ball. His throw. Not in time. That'll be an infield single. Luis Terrero steps in here. Last season he hit four out of the park. With a career slugging percentage under 400. Fastball in there. It's all in one. The 0 1 pitch is a fastball for a called strike. With two strikes, you got to swing at anything close. Slider swung on and missed. Two down. When you pitch a hitter inside, you better not make a mistake and get it over the plate. He doesn't right here. Perfect pitch down and in. Chad Tracy will be batting. Last season he had eight home runs with a career slugging percentage under 410. First pitch to him. Here's one high and inside for ball one. Ready with the 1-0 pitch. Swing and a fly ball down the left field line. Abbott is right there and he will put it away to retire the side. 
The Diamondbacks pick up no runs on one hit and spray a tight. They've been coming up here at Bank One Ballpark, and our score is nothing, nothing. The six, seven, eight hitters are coming up next. Raul Mondesi is due up second in the next half inning. First pitch on the way. Ball one. Here's the 1-0 delivery. 1-0 pitch is a slider swung on and missed. 1-1. One one. Now the 1-1 pitch. Swing and a miss on a fastball and it's 1-2. And, and man that's 1-0-1 -on -one power baseball right there. The 1-2 pitch. Inside for a ball and the count's even now 2-2. 2-2 two, two pitch. Swung on and ripped towards second. Council gets there in time to make the great running catch. So he got a pitch he could handle, but unfortunately he could not get it past the second base. Mondesi will be the batter. 0 for 1 thus far. Nobody on base with one out. First pitch, here it comes. And that swung on and missed. 0-1. That was a monster cut at a hard breaking curveball. He throws. 0 oh 2. The pitcher's got him right where he wants him. He's got a lot of pitches to play with. Now here's a swing, and the ball hit well down the left field line. It may have a chance. And foul. And he fouls this one off. Swung on, hit softly towards the hole. Tracy is there on the first four out number two. Abbott will be the batter. 0 for 1 thus far. Two outs, nobody on. First pitch to him. And this one's wide. Now let's see if they're going to walk him intentionally here. The 1 0 pitch on the way. And there's ball two. Two and zero pitch on the way. Ball three, that's out. The three zero pitch, here it comes. Pitch out, but nothing doing that time. John, this pitch had to be in the middle of the plate, not up and away. Hudson will be the batter. Zero for one thus far. Runner on first, two outs. First pitch on the way. Fastball swung on it, missed 0 and 1. The 0 1 pitch, a fastball swung on it, missed 0 and 2. He throws. And this is hit in the air, foul down the left field line. This is swung on and hit on the ground. Clayton has got it. Throws the first and the side is retired. The Braves can't get anybody home here this happening. We go to the bottom of the fifth and it's still nothing nothing. It's the number eight nine and one hitters coming up. Robbie Hammett will be the first man up. First pitch here it comes. The thing that makes a splitter tough to hit is it breaks down and it also has late movement. The 0 1 pitch is a changeup swung on and missed 0 and 2. There's two quick ones and now the hitter's really in trouble. Here's a swing and the ball popped up foul down the left field line. Swing and a miss on the sinker. One away. That sinking fastball will get the job done every time. Nice pitch. You'll see this one going up and away as a hitter. That pitch looks easy to make contact with, but it can be deceiving at times. Joe, he goes down swinging here, and you can bet that his confidence went down a little bit just right with it. First pitch. 
swung out, hit down the left field line, into the corner, and foul. The pitch. There's a swing and a fly ball down the line and left. And foul. Struck him out, and that's strikeout number eight thus far. Well, he was looking dead red. He got the fastball, but he could not make contact. Strike three. John, now we'll get a chance to see the four-seam fastball on Kazon. You'll see this thing get tracked to the lower corner of the plate. It looked like the batter thought he had this one, but in the end, it was just too much for him to have. Not the way he was looking to end that at bat, Joe. First pitch is a splitter for a called strike. Let's see what he wants to do now. No balls, two strikes. A lot of different ways he can go here. Got it. And that is the ninth strikeout of the game. Here's the replay of those last three pitches. Great pitches on the replay. Yeah, nice work, Joe. He didn't give him much to hit that time, that's for sure. No runs, no hits, and no one left on. We're through five here at the ballpark, and our score is nothing, nothing. And for the benefit of those who have just tuned in, here's a reminder that this is John Miller along with Joe Morgan. This is Major League Baseball on ESPN. The top of the order is due up next. Chipper Jones is due up third. He's got to be in the pitcher's mind right now. He'll be up third in the next inning. Cut fastball. Swings and lines this one back up the middle. Ortiz is there and puts it away for out number one. Giles will stand in. He's 0 for 2 thus far. First pitch, here it comes. He swings and it's a fly ball to right field. Green is right there and he puts it away. Not a bad swing, but he's too far underneath it. And the result is an easy fly to right. Bases empty, two down. First pitch on the way. Sharp curveball swung out of this. 0 and 1. Here it comes. Grounded back to the mound. Tracy is there. And he'll step on first to retire the side. The Atlanta Braves aren't able to push across anything and have been shut out through the first six. Now we'll go to the last of the six in a scoreless ball game. And they've got the two, three, four spots due up next. Troy Gloss is due up third, and they're going to have to watch out for him. Ball one. Slider just misses. One ball, no strikes. Here's the 1-0 delivery. The 1-0 pitch is a fastball in there. One and one. That fastball up and in will keep the hitter from leaning out over the plate. The 1-1 one, one pitch on the way. Ball two. Change up just off the corner and it's 2-1. and one. Here's the 2-1 pitch on the way. Swung on and missed that time and it's 2-2 two and two now. The 2-2 two, two pitch. Got him, and that is strikeout number 10 in this game. John, he's got such great motion with his changeup, these hitters are having all kinds of problems. He's fan 10 with it here. Gonzalez will come to the plate, two for two in this one. Base is empty with one out. First pitch on the way. Down a swing and a ball hit foul. Misses too low for a ball. One and one. The one one pitch on the way. And there's a ball hit pretty well down the line in right. This ball is curving. Mondesi is back to the warning track, but he makes the catch. And he's pitching well right now. That's seven straight he's retired. Troy Gloss gets a shot here. His average is at 252. He's hitting 250. Grounded back to the mound. Jones is up with it. His throw not in time. And that'll be an infield single. John, with two outs, you just want to hit a ball hard somewhere. And he comes up with a solid base hit. 
He winds up with a throw he has to make all the way across the diamond. He just couldn't get it there in time. Now, if this was a throw being made by a second baseman with his arm, uh, I don't think it would have been any kind of a play at all. He wouldn't have even had a chance at it. But uh, this guy had enough speed to beat that long, strong throw. Absolutely. Fastball in there for a called strike. There he goes towards second. Part two. And he's in there at second. Here's another look at the steal. He beats the throw easily. Yeah. And I tell you what, he didn't have much of a jump from first base, Joe. That slide I thought was a, a big one. Well, sometimes, John, you can tip the pitcher off if you get too big a lead. So he did a good job on this one. He delivers. He's out of there. Struck him out. And that is now 11 strikeouts in the ballgame. The Diamondbacks are shut down again and that's six innings without a run so far. At the end of six full innings in a scoreless ballgame. The big hitters, power hitters, the middle of the batting order coming up. Andrew Jones is due up. Swing at a ground ball to short. Clayton has it on the hop. Over to first for out number one. Jones will stand in. He's 0 for 2 thus far. Base is empty. One out. First pitch. Here it comes. Here's a check swing, but it's called a strike anyway. All in one. Back the fastball by him that time, and he's in control now. 0 and 2. Swing and a miss on the cutter that time. Oh, too bad. John, that pitch is down and in. That shows great control right there. That'll finish the job anytime. LaRoche will stand in. He's 0 for 2 thus far. Two outs, nobody on. First pitch to him. Fastball in there for a called strike. And the hitter thought that was inside, but it's right there on the corner. Swing and a miss, and he falls behind 0 and 2. Tried to saw him off that time, but he missed with it. One and two. A one-two pitch coming. Ball two. Here's the two-two pitch. Fastball swung out and missed, and the sign is the time. Pedro will show us a look here at the four-seam fastball. You'll see this thing get tracked to the lower corner of the plate. It looked like the batter thought he had this one, but in the end, it was just too much for him to handle. Not the way he was looking to end that at bat, Joe. The Atlanta Braves just can't figure anything out. Through seven, and remain without the benefit of a run. Seven inning stretch time here in the desert in a scoreless ball game. The numbers six, seven, eight hitters are coming up. Robbie Hammond will try and get something started. He's up third in the next inning. First pitch on the way. Starts him out with a changeup for a strike. That's a tough pitch to commit to there. You never look for a changeup down and in. The pitch. Strike two. Got it. And that is strikeout number 12 for him. Man, that's a hard slider with a nice leg break, John. That's a great two-strike pitch. Tough one to hit. This one will run down and away a little bit, but as you can see, Kazon would have still called it a strike. Well, he does go down swinging here, and uh, his confidence uh, goes down a little bit right with it. First pitch, here it comes. There's a strike at the knees. 0-1. Too high for a ball. One ball, one strike. One ball, one strike to pitch. Swings and lines this one towards the hole. And that's into right field for a base hit. The throw to second. 
This is good bat speed here. Inside fastball, he really turns on it. Hammock will stand in. He's 0 for 2 thus far. First pitch to him. Swing and an easy ground ball to short. To second for one. On to first. Swing says they can't get the back in. Well, they get the lead runner at second, but they can't turn two. Ortiz will step in. One for two in the ballgame. Two outs, a man on first. First pitch on the way. Here's another look at the wild pitch, John. I know he wishes he had this one back. Well, I don't know if he just tried to snap it off a little too hard, held a little bit too long. Whatever, he's given up uh, an extra base there. The 0 1 pitch, a fastball swung on and missed. 0 and 2. And he struck him out. That is 13 strikeouts in this one. The Diamondback just can't figure anything out. And through seven, they remain without the benefit of a run. We'll move ahead to the eighth in a scoreless ballgame. It's the bottom three of the batting order coming up. Raul Mondesi will be the first man up. First pitch, here it comes. There's a swing and a ground ball. Ortiz is right there, and his throw gets him. One away. That will be the batter. 0 for 1 thus far. Base is empty. One out. First pitch to him. Starts him out with a curveball for a called strike. On the ground to third. Gloss has got it. And the first. Two down. Terrific job on this play by the third baseman. He fires the ball on the first to nab the runner. Base is empty. Two down. First pitch on the way. Swung on and ripped towards second. Council has got it. Throws on the first in time to retire the second. The Braves are held in check again. As they are now scoreless through eight. Here come the Diamondbacks in the home half of the eighth in a scoreless ballgame. And the top of the order is coming up. Luis Gonzalez will try and get something started. He's up third in the next inning. First pitch to him. Pitch on the way. And here's a fly ball to straightaway left. Abbott is there and he puts it away. He swings under this one, and the result is an easy out. Clayton will come to bat now. He's one for three in the game. First pitch, here it comes. And he swings and hits this one foul. Got the fastball by him that time, and he's in control now. 0 oh and 2. Two great pitches right on the edge. Now he's got him in trouble. Pop him up. Back behind home plate. A swing and a bullet towards the hole. Jones has it. And he throws the first in time for out number two. Gonzalez will bat here. He's two for three thus far. Two outs, nobody on. There's a swing and a liner towards first. LaRoche is there. The Diamondbacks still can't buy a run. They've been held scoreless here through eight. But through eight, ninth inning coming up in a scoreless ball game. Top of the lineup coming up now. Chipper Jones, always a hitter to watch, and he'll be coming up third in the inning. First pitch on the way. Here's a swing and a fly ball to right center. Council is over, and he puts it away for the out. Giles will step in. He's 0 for 3 up to this point. One out, none on. First pitch to him. If you stay down, you're not going to get hurt. Just keep the fastball low. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He deals. Mm -hmm. And this one's grounded a second. Council has it. On the first four out of the two. Tracy with the off-balance throw, and he got him. This is a heck of a play. 
I'll tell you what, he makes this throw look relatively easy, but a lot of times you release this ball and just hope you get it somewhere in the vicinity of the bag. Jones will dig in now. Switch hitter who bats left-handed. First pitch, here it comes. Ball one. Well, if you get that pitch down and not up, the hitter has to chase it. Now the 1 0 pitch. The 1 0 pitch, a fastball swung on and missed. 1 and 1. Here's the 1 1 delivery. Good downward action on that one, and it's 1 and 2. He's trying to hit it to the parking lot, but that's a tough pitch to handle. Here's the 1 2 pitch on the way. There's a swing of the liner towards first. Tracy is there to make the catch and the side is retired. The Braves still can't push across any runs and it's looking more and more like the first team to score will be the team that wins. And we move on to the left. And this is hit in the air to straightaway left. Abbott is there and he makes the catch. He swings under this one and the result is an easy out. Green will step in. He's over three up at this point. First pitch to him. And that's down and in for a ball. 1 0. Well, you get that fastball down and in, a lot of times you're just going to get the ground ball that you're looking for. The 1 0 pitch is a changeup. Swung on and missed. 1 and 1. Hey now, big shot. One ball, one strike. Here's the pitch. As a pitcher, you're always taught keep the ball down. The 1 2 pitch. You're out of there. Changeup. Swung on and missed. And that is out number two. He's looking for a fastball, John, but he got the changeup. Going right through it, strike three. Kazon will show us a look here at the changeup. Well, he only had four pitches in that at bat, but let's go back and take a look at him. Yeah, it's a great pitching, Joe. Base is empty, two down here. First pitch on the way. On the outside corner for a called strike. He kicks, he throws. The off speed pitch is in there, and he falls behind 0 and 2. Changeup is swung out of this, and that will retire the side. Three pitches, but he's out. Great pitching here. Let's take a look at the replay. Yeah, strike one, strike two, strike three, and see you later. The Diamondbacks still can't break through, so both pitching staffs have thrown nine shutout innings. A little extra baseball today. We head to the 10 in a scoreless ball game. The heart of the order coming up next. Andrew Jones is due up second in the next half inning. First pitch on the way. Swings and misses at that fastball. It's 0-1. Took something off that time, and he's in control. It's 0-2. will step in. He's 0 for 3 up to this point. One out, nobody on. First pitch to him. Starts him out with a fastball for a strike. Strike two. The 0 1 pitch, a fastball swung on and missed. 0 and 2. He's way ahead in the count. All the pressure falls on the hitter now. He's got to make contact. Swing and a miss on the fastball. That's the second out of the inning. Well, he was looking dead red. He got the fastball, but he could not make contact. Strike three. Oloche will step in. He's 0 for 3 up to this point. Base is empty. Two down here. First pitch. Here it comes. Swings and misses at that fastball. It's 0 and 1. He delivers. High and tight that time to even the count at 1-1. A lot of times that fastball up and in can be the toughest pitch for anybody to hit. Here's the 1-1 pitch. Hurt two. A 1-2 pitch coming. There's a swing and a liner towards first. Tracy is there to put it on the high. And he'll step on first to retire the side. 
the Atlanta Braves still can't push across any runs and it's looking more and more like the first team to score will be the team that wins. We'll go to the bottom of any number 10 and we have no score. It's the last third of the batting order coming up. Robbie Hammett is due no, up second in the next half inning. Started to go around, but he held up in time. One ball, no strikes. The 1 0 pitch on the way. 1 0 pitch is a changeup in there. 1 and 1. He had movement on that changeup and it moved down and in. Not a 1 1 pitch. Good spot for the changeup that time. 1 and 2. Here's the 1 2 pitch on the way. Big swing and miss on a fastball, and he struck him out. 1 away. Man, that's a tough pitch. All he could hope to do there is foul it off, but he swung right through it. Hammett will step in. He's 0 for 3 up to this point. Nobody on base with one out. First pitch to him. Took something off, and it swung on and missed. Strike one. The 0 1 pitch, a fastball swung on and missed. 0 and 2. The pitch, a swing and a fly ball to left center field. Jones dives and he made the catch. Wow, what a play. And you want to talk about settling in, eight in a row he's retired now. Jones with a fabulous play, a sensational play in the outfield. Well, it looks like this ball's running away from him too, John, but he says not so fast and he makes a nice super diving catch. Two outs, nobody on. First pitch on the way. Ball one. Ooh, and he lays off the fastball. Good pitch. One ball, one strike. Well, they're not going to chase pitches up and away. Thank He's going to have to get the ball down before they start swinging. Good spot for the changeup that time. One and two. The one two pitch. Change up. Got it. And the sign is retired. Well, he's in good pitching rhythm now, John. This strikeout on four pitches sits the hitter down. Yeah, he just blew him away. The Arizona Diamondbacks still can't break through. So both pitching staffs have thrown nine shutout innings. We'll move on to inning number 11, and our score is nothing, nothing. It's the last third of the batting order coming up. Raul right. Mondesi will be the first man up. First pitch to him. Hyper. Swings and misses at the good change. It's 0-1. Back the fastball two. by him that time, and he's in control now, 0-2. Here's the pitch. He swings and lines this one softly toward the left side. Lawrence is there and he puts it away. Abbott will stand in. He's 0 for 2 thus far. One out. Nobody on. First pitch. Here it comes. First pitch is a fastball in there for a strike. Man, that's what you call popping the mitt. Right on the outside corner. Down and away. The 0 1 pitch is a curve swung on and missed. 0 and 2. Fastball. Got it. Two down. He's obviously a low ball hitter. He couldn't catch up with that one. That's up and away. He decides to swing at this one, but he couldn't get the bat square to the ball in time. Excellent pitching right there. It certainly was. Got to give credit to the pitcher for getting him to chase that one. Two outs, nobody on. First pitch on the way. That's on the outside corner for a strike. Man, big rip at that one, but he was looking for something else. Got it. So now they'll have their chance to win this game with a run in the bottom half. We've got a second now to see the four-seam fastball on Kazon. Nice pitch on the inside corner, and he got a chase it. Boy, he wanted that one. You could see it in his body language. He just got out dueled by the pitcher on that one. The Braves still can't push across any runs, and it's looking more and more 
like the first team to score will be the team that wins. We go now to the last of the 11, tied 0-0. It'll be the leadoff man trying to get things going here. Luis Gonzalez will try and get something started. He's up third in the next inning. First pitch, a slider in there, 0-1. Ooh, and he lays off the fastball. Good pitch. One ball, one strike. One ball, one strike. The pitch. He baffled him with the curve that time. One and two. A one-two pitch coming. There's a swing and a ground ball. Cole is up with it, and they'll get to him in time for the tag out. Clayton will dig in. He's had one hit in four trips. One out, none on. First pitch on the way. Sliders in there. No ball to the strike. He kicks, he throws. Swing and a ground ball to third. Jones is there. And he throws the first in time for out number two. Gonzalez will step in. He's had a couple of hits in four trips to the plate. Bases empty, two down. First pitch, here it comes. Called strike in the outer half. All in one. Got the fastball by him that time, and he's in control now. 0 and 2. Man, he put everything into that swing. That one would have traveled a long way if he would have hit it. Curveball ties him in knots as he swings and misses strike three in the side of the top. He was punished in here, John. Three great pitches. Well, he's got to have great stuff because you don't see guys go down at three pitches like that very often. Very nice. The Arizona Diamondbacks still can't break through, so both pitching staffs have thrown nine shutout innings. We move on to the 12th in a scoreless ball game. The top of the order is due up next. Chipper Jones is known for being a very fine hitter. He's due up third in the inning. Fastball in there, and it's 0-1. Pitcher has an 0-2. I look for him to go inside and then back outside. Now here's a swing and a ground ball. Clayton is right there. And the throw is in time for the first out of the inning. That shortstop's right there to glove it. And then fires to first base for the out. A very, very close play at first base that time. Let's see this from another angle. When we slow it down, you see the ball gets there just before his foot hits the bag. Good call. Nobody on base with one out. First pitch to him. Swings and misses at the good change. It's 0-1. He throws. Ball one. The 1-1 pitch on the way. Man, was he fooled on that pitch. Change up. Got him swing. Here's the 1-2 pitch on the way. And this is hit in the air, foul down the left field line. The one-two pitch. A change up that time, and he swings and misses. Strikes for his two away. When you pitch a hitter inside, you better not make a mistake and get it over the plate. He doesn't right here. Perfect pitch, down and in. Jones, he's a switch hitter, batting right-handed. Two outs, nobody on. First pitch on the way. This one swung on and fouled away. Foul ball. And he fouls this one off. Foul ball. He's out of Struck him out. So now they'll go to work and see if they can win it in the bottom half of the inning. We've got a second now to see the four-seam fastball in case. A fantastic strikeout pitch here. It's headed down and in. The batter just didn't have time to adjust. He never had a chance on this one. Not a real good swing, Joe. But you've got to give the pitcher credit, too. He made the pitch, and the batter couldn't handle it. Yeah, but they're just a bad swing. Yes, it was. The Atlanta Braves still can't push across any runs, and it's looking more and more 
like the first team to score into the team that wins. On now to the last of inning number 12, and our score is nothing, nothing. The big hitters in the lineup. Swung on and hit in the air to right center. As it will, in fact, as you see, go all the way to the wall. Around second now, he's heading for third. And he is safe at third. Just did slide in ahead of the play. Green will be the batter. He's 0 for 4 in this one. A runner in scoring position at third base and nobody Breaking out here. Breaking ball swung out and missed. It's 0 and 1. Here is the pitch. On the ground to second. And that'll bring a run home. The throw to the plate. The Arizona Diamondbacks. Come out victorious here, Joe. And these fans are going to head home happy. The home team gave them the happy ending. Well, they should be happy, John. Not only did they win the ball game, but they played well. And in the end, they wore their opponents down, so the home team goes away happy. Russ Ortiz pitched a shutout ball in this one, and there is absolutely no question that he's our ESPN Video Games player of the game. Well, no question, Ortiz was the man out there on the mound. He's not going to overpower you with his stuff, but he really had the full arsenal working in this one. Another solid outing for Ortiz. That wraps up things from here. A reminder to join Carl Ravitch for baseball tonight following this and every ESPN telecast. Now, for my Hall of Fame partner, Joe Morgan, and our entire ESPN crew, this is John Miller. Thanks for tuning in. And once again, the final score in 12 innings. The Arizona Diamondbacks get the win one to nothing. This has been a presentation of ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports. For more, log on to ESPN.com. So long from Phoenix.